doing a uh, reverse butterfly waist strap tutorial. And, um, one second. Okay, that's going to turn out to look something like this. be able to go back and forth like that or like that or hold it over like that. You know. Whoops. Yeah, just be able to be comfortable with that. So that's one thing you need to know also. You'll probably need to know uh, reverse butterfly thread the needles. So, and also, perhaps behind the back, butterflies might help too, and as well as uh, butterfly hip rolls, reverse butterfly hip rolls like this. Alright, okay, well, how this move works is, I'm going to show you from the side, well, the first thing you need to do is, I'm just going to let you know this. Okay. You notice I'm going to be in a butterfly hip row. Okay. And now what I'm going to want to have is my right poi to cross over the waist strap right there. And in order for that to happen, my right poi has to pass from behind my back over in front of me without tangling up and hitting this poi. To uh, make that happen, it, you're going to have this poi kind of hang back so you're going to see a gap between your arm and your back. And that's going to be the window for your uh, poi that's doing the waist strap to cross. So uh, you'll just kind of notice that. So this poi moves back, this poi moves this way in front of me, okay? And as this poi, my right poi, comes out in front of me, my left poi is going to then begin to chase my right poi. So you'll notice, if you notice, my right poi actually comes out in front of me first, then my left poi just kind of scoops in front of me like that. So, to be able to get into that, uh, you might want to try to do a uh, hip reel, butterfly hip reel, and then just, you're going to bring your right foot behind and leave your left one behind. So just kind of notice how I'm doing that. show you that from the side a few times. Alright. And uh, when you're first doing this, you know, just try doing that for a while and, you know, go back to a uh, butterfly hip reel, then you know, do it again, then go back, do it again, then go back. And maybe once you get used to doing that, just try doing it over here on one side. Look at that. Alright. Now you're going to want to have learn how to do it on the opposite side. We'll do the same thing. So now each hand is going to be switching jobs. So now my right hand is going to create that window between my back and my arm. 
and my left boy's going to come over and swing in front of me. So I'll do that with my left as well. So you can see how that works. It's the exact same thing. It's just opposite hands are doing opposite things on the opposite side of your body. And that's all that is to that. So once again, learn that just by doing that. Get used to that. Then learn it like that. And then you're uh, pretty much ready to, uh, you know, link them together and take it on either side of your body. Go on either side of your body. And you should be able to figure this out pretty easily if you're comfortable doing uh, them both on either side of your body and also doing them from that to a, uh, doing the waist strap back into a uh, hip rope. It shouldn't be too hard to figure out, but I'm going to show you uh, how to do that from uh, the back view. So kind of study it, look at it, and see how it all works. Try to make it as slow as possible for you. And that's pretty much it. I hope you have fun with that.